We are DIY remodeling this entire house and here's everything we've done on this bathroom so far. Since it's a 1930s house, we wanted to salvage as much as we could, including the tile and the pedestal sink, and then we realized that's really unrealistic and they're not gonna look good. With these big DIY remodels, things change all the time and you kind of have to be flexible and just go with the flow. Since we're not experienced, we were kind of just winging it and hoping everything would work out. Unfortunately, it has so far. We had to remove all the lath and plaster on the walls and remove all of that old shower tile. I used a shovel, a hammer, a sledgehammer, and many other things to get the lath and plaster off, and as you can see, it makes a massive mess. I had to clean up all this mess and pry the hundreds of nails on the walls to get it ready for drywall eventually. We sadly had to remove our favorite tile in the house and then about six inches of concrete under it to get to the subfloor. Then from that subfloor, we cut the boards out to get down into the crawl space where we redid all of the plumbing and eventually the electrical in the bathroom as well. In the DIY world, not everything makes sense and goes in order, but then I realized I needed to remove this bulkhead. So I did that, put the floors in, put the drywall in and got the walls, the bathtub and the floors leveled. So a lot of projects,